Well, here's a couple of knives been working on so far today. Uh, got this one kind of semi-polished out. Well, this is how the fish fillet knife looks. You can tell it's uh, 11 inches long. Uh, I used a hacksaw blade, mechanical saw that I had, and uh, I never have tried to make a knife out of that, but I thought, man, that would make a really good fish fillet knife. And so I cut, cut a shape out that I liked. I'm probably gonna make a template of that and it would be easier uh, to make it longer or shorter, just however uh, needed to do it. Well, I'm making this knife for this guy that's he's fixing to retire, and he just loves to go fishing. And so I thought, well, I'll, I'll make him a knife, but uh, I don't know that he goes deer hunting all that much. Fishing is his real thing. So I thought, well, man, uh, you know, a fillet knife would be the thing to make for him. So anyway, I wanted to be sure and put my logo on it. and. Uh, I was going to etch that on there just like I did on some of the others. And I just kind of dab on and off. The sticker material that I use, I, I have like a little uh, sign company make these little stickers. They're, they're a one time use. And uh, the type of sticker it is, you've seen like these real estate signs that they stick on the edge of property that have those little vinyl letters. What I do is I have them cut out this real small little decal and uh, it doesn't cost very much. I have like a salt water solution that I use on this cotton pad. And the reaction between the battery charger and uh, the salt water and metal does the etching effect. Well, you saw how long it took to do it and I didn't cut any time out. I mean, it's, it's pretty fast acting and you get a really good result. It actually etches into the steel and uh, it's not just kind of a surface treatment, uh, it actually etches in there. Uh, and I, I really like how, it, how that works. But uh, anyway, I'll clean that up and I'm going to get busy and uh, make some scales. I've got some uh, new material I'm gonna use and uh, I'll bring you back later. Here's the three knives. Uh, I'm pretty much done with them right now. I'm going to uh, make sheaths for each one of them. We'll be getting done with that just pretty soon. I plan on starting on the Kydex sheaths just real quick, so uh, maybe I'll get started on the leather one tomorrow.